Hello and welcome to Math Matters. I'm Mrs. Wall and today we're going to learn about equality. Previously we've learned about scales, how to balance them, and how to write an equation or number sentence that shows equality. We're going to continue with similar math thinking today. For our math time you will need a piece of paper and a pencil. I'm going to give you a couple moments to gather those materials. Let's start today by getting our brains thinking. Take a moment to look at these two pictures. What might be the same and what is different? One way these two pictures are different is that one picture has kittens and one picture has red dots. One way these pictures are the same is they both show the number five. There are five kittens in one picture and five dots on the other one. What other ideas did you come up with? I wonder, can you make five with your fingers? I just did it with one hand. Is there another way to make five, but using both of your hands? I have four and one on the other hand. Okay, let's keep going. Now let's look at this picture of a scale. Is the balance equal? Yes, how do we know that the balance is equal? We know the balance is equal because it shows the same number of counters on each side. What equation could we write to show this scale? When looking at the scale, we see that one side has two blue counters and four orange counters, and the other side of the scale has six green counters. 
One equation we could write for this balance scale is 2 plus 4 equals or is the same as 6. What about this scale? What do you notice about this scale? We know that the amount of counters on each side of the scale must be the same since the scale is balanced. We can see that there are green counters on one side and blue and orange counters on the other side. What equation could we write to match this balance scale? Did one of the equations or number sentences that you wrote look like this? This is a true number sentence because there are seven green counters on one side and seven total counters on the other side. There are blue and orange counters on the other side. We know that there are seven blue and orange counters because we can see five blue counters and two orange counters. We could use a counting on strategy by saying five blue, then saying six, seven, when we count on those orange counters. Our number sentence could be seven equals or is the same as five plus two. Take a moment to look at this scale. What do you notice? Did you write your thinking down on your piece of paper? If not, go ahead and write your thinking down on your piece of paper. There are nine green circles on one side of the balance scale. On the other side of the balance scale, there are four blue circles and five orange circles. Nine equals or is the same as four plus five.
We know 4 plus 5 is 9 because 4 and 4 equals 8, and 5 is 1 more than 4. So 1 more than 8 is 9. 9 equals 4 plus 5. Now you try. Use your paper and pencil to finish this equation so that it matches the balance scale. It was fun doing math with you today. In today's episode of Math Matters, we learned about making equations with our balancing scales. I hope you have a mathematical day and keep on counting. I'm Mrs. Wall and I look forward to doing more math with you soon. Have a great day.